So, I'm back with the next part of the campaign. I just thought I'd start right out of the battlefield. So, we need to take position again. I remember last time I kind of rage quitted that. <laughs> so, these guys will form the center again. These guys up here, I want to make a strong right flank. A little bit weaker left flank. Sorry if I sound kinda messed up. I'm not feeling the best or ever did. But yeah, a lot of people actually have colds this year. I know that Duplex has a cold. I think Marshall Adin also is about to get a cold. <laughs> so yeah, well, it's just the time of the year that people get colds. So whatever, just gotta live with that. It's very basic setup. And let's face these guys. Group them up. Move them up a bit. Oh, shoot. I told them all to run. I want them not to run. <laughs> Fail. Well, I don't have any missiles, so it doesn't matter if I had the right run. Well, it does matter, since I should only run when I'm in their missile range. So I have these iron crossbowmen and the other... The axe throwers. These axe throwers are actually charging head on into my men. So they'll be the first victims. I'm gonna take these guys... Here. Group them. Move like this. But it's good. They're a bunch of miners. Why does the feet seem almost certain? It's kind of laggy, I don't know. It's weird. These crossbowmen are getting charged. These guys aren't though. We should fix that. It's hard to play with that much lag. They're retreating. Oh, if these are the bodyguards, then I can charge in these guys here. Cool, so these miners are broken. And why have I not moved up these guys? There's some good infantry. Circle these guys. Load these guys. Let's see how I'm doing on this flank. These miners get screwed over pretty much. So you can move up here. Not you guys, you stay in the fight. You should have these guys. Oh shoot, I got some breaking. Oh, these guys. Well, that's okay. Minus will break here. And they're under pressure here. I 
Well, if we win this battle, we sh charge the miners just to stop them. I know it's not a really good idea, but I don't want to have them back attacking my guys, so I'll just charge them. I want these guys to break first or be somewhat beaten. Miners, warriors, axemen, heavy infantry, or noblemen. What are these guys doing? Oh. Okay, they're finding some miners. It's really painful though that it's so laggy and. Yeah, these. Oh, come on, break. Why are these guys so far away from the battlefield? They really shouldn't be. You can go help your friends out. Their center has to break. What are these guys doing? The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. That's good. Well, percentage I like killed 43, 48. The rest of the troops will be the missile units. Still, the missile units probably have better quality than my troops. Well, it's okay if I lose the wards here. In the siege, they're not gonna have a huge effect. I should retreat these guys. They're so ha tired. They're not gonna have good, good performance, I suppose. Hmm. But it seems like we're winning. I don't really want to get rid of these stupid. These stupid missile units. I should try and get. Only half our force remains. Yeah, well, percentage enemies killed is 54%. These heavy infantry are screwed. Huh. Holy shit, they're all gonna be dead. Yep, I lost an entire unit. All the dwarves didn't do well as well, so... Yeah. These X-Men. Aw, oh, cause they had these stupid reinforcements. Now we're losing like crazy. I don't know, my music just disappeared. This spell really seems glitched up. Well, I lost this one, I suppose. Not much we can do here. Well, I didn't manage my troops really well. So that's the reason for this defeat. And obviously they had the same amount of men and better quality. Oh well, I'm 
I'm gonna tell my units to withdraw. Since there's no sense in just losing even more men. Because right now it's 12% more casualties and I can live with that. But losing all my units would be horrible. So... Yep, we lost. Whatever. Hmm. Run like the wind. Well, the fate seems almost certain. Hmm, I could just exit the battle, I think. Men lost 1,900, 400 men remaining, and a thousand is what they lost. So they have a thousand men remaining. So they won't retake any of my settlements, but I won't be able to take their town either. So it pretty much is a stalemate. They stopped my offense, I suppose. I'll accept the ransom. And we will pull back. Oh, the free people are offering something, I think. Oh, what? They're attacking me? Stupid douchebags. They're attacking the camp. That's really stupid. And I won't be able to stop them here. Aww. Oh well. And they attack me as well. Holy shit, man. They're attacking the camp. Everything's like falling apart. So I'll have to recruit like crazy. Oh, we're already recruiting here. We aren't here and we can't recruit anything. We'll have to push back. Still don't have the... Well, their troops aren't really high quality, so if I take these guys down there, I might be able to beat them. Or I could stay here and hope that the conversion goes fast enough that I can recruit some units. Hmm, I don't think so, though. Not good situation. Not good situation. Well, our armorer will be finished, and the troll cage will be next. I would like to push the elves of the Imladris, but <laughs> that is a crazy plan. But let's get him down here and recruit some mercenaries. Mercenary captain, yeah. Um, oh well, I should be able to defend Gundabad. No, I'm not gonna get into that. And I'm gonna have a recruitment possibility there as well soon, ish. Oh, 
Well, I'm gonna try and defend that, because that seems possible. So I now do need a massive amount of troops. Dart deployment. Do I have any missile units? Yeah, I do. Wait, they have ladders? Yeah, they have some. So I place these guys on the wars for now. here well a lot of the troops are bows and they won't help them anyways they're gonna move up or just let the ballista shoot me well ballistas aren't really effective against wolves so they can shoot a long time before they do any damage. Well, they hit some of my dudes. I'm gonna get up the wall. <laughs> Screw your stupid ballista. Ballista doesn't really do any building damage. Well, that's some, but... It's neglectable. Come on, like really? Will you let the Bedusta shoot it out? Wow, the walls actually crumbled. Huh. Yeah, it's 2% of damage for each shot. So they're gonna try and take these walls down, so I'll need to line up here. Well, they only get Sword Quendi, which I don't know what that is, but... It seems like Light Inf... It's not Light Infantry, so these probably are beatable. So, I think of a, if I think of a plan here, the best idea might be to place my calf behind here. Your bodyguards as well. Place the spears behind the wall entrance and just chill out there. Let my arrows shoot some of them down. And once they try to breach this hole, ride out through the gate and hammer an anvil them. Looks like a reasonable plan. And the, also, if they run in here, they're also gonna get shot by the towers. What the f fuck? Shit. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. I don't need to stay on the walls. Stupid ballista. Really, that's annoying. Why are they shooting the walls half weighted down and then they stop? So retarded. Come on. Well, the time runs in favor of me. Oh, they moved up. Well, some of these are going down, they're not heavily armored, I think. Or she doesn't want trying to scale the walls. If I had more bowmen, none defense would really be easy. These guys are getting screwed. I 
need some men up these walls. Not really men, but need someone to climb these walls so that they don't move up here. Well, they got pretty killed on the way. Could be that they rode before they managed to climb up the walls. What the fuck, man? Why did they shoot the walls down and then now they're trying to ram them down? Really? What the fuck? Uh, no, no, you stay. Stop. The enemy are battering down the gates. They're not gonna get up the walls. Never, ever, ever. So I need to reform my ranks here and here. Well, I could. Can these guys do Sheltron? Yeah, it's really works well if you try and place a shelter on bef in front of the gates usually works out pretty well drive back these stupid sword quandy and should get down these guys That's gonna slaughter at least. That's gonna be a pretty good victory, I think. That's what I hope for. Well, I'd screw the stupid children. I'd rather defend. I have... no I don't. But once these sword Quendi are beaten, beaten back here, I can move the, them down here and completely encircle them behind the gates. Well, a lot of them are gonna get shot to pieces. See it, look at this. This is crazy. Some good losses for them. And they're gonna route here as well. So these elves get severely outmatched here. Can I? Oh yeah, I'll fire this book Wendy as well then. I should really change my strategy now, since I've a, I'm at war with so many people. But I need to defend and get missile units into the cities. Because you saw these guys wreaked havoc and they're not even good missile units. Can they even fire? No. You know, they reformed. The feast seems certain, and these stalkers will kill them. Well, they're. <laughs> they get killed pretty bad. They are still getting killed pretty bad. I'd like to see you finally opening fire on these guys. Yeah, that's good. Oh, who? I was already scared and it'll crash again. <laughs> well, reforming? That's actually such a thing. That's interesting. Oh my, I wanted to see these guys going down. Oh fuck, they're actually breaking through, I think. At least they're making a push. Yeah, these guys are broken. So get the fuck down here and help. the book when you're doing that signing down here <laughs> it's not really worth shooting at them though it's 
It's only five men who we can fire. It's not gonna really do any damage. The annoying thing about having orcish archers in this game is that, well, not they're not orcs, but you know, it's not got archers. A lot of units in this game, like the archers, pretty much all the elven archers, the Rohan archers, the Gondor archers, they're all having the trait that they have the very far firing missiles, which in the original medieval total war, that'd be like the English longbows and such have that. And yeah, the problem is they don't really have that and they'll just outfire me in a regular battle by the range. And some of these are routing. Well, it'd be a good idea to shoot them down while they're routing. So I'll survive. shoot a volley at them, I think. Yeah, they took tremendous losses. We took some losses, but... For the moment, the fortune of battle goes our way. And pray it remains as such. gonna run them down. <laughs> They're falling like crazy, that's so great. Well, these guys will get some experience like crazy. <laughs> be kind of funny if they tried assaulting me and none of their men will ever get back. <laughs> well, I charged their ballista crew. Oh, they still have some men running here. 16, we'll get rid of them. Fighting to the death? What the fuck? If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. How much left are these guys? Twelve. Well, I'm gonna hope they're never gonna come back. And well, these poke when you're obviously never gonna come back. <laughs> Shoot, I'm getting shredded to pieces by the stupid ballista. I think. Yeah, stu stupid, stupid, stupid ballista. Really? Kinda looks like their swords are rusty or out of wood. Also, they're not <laughs> Sylvan Elves, so they're not really wood freaks. I never really use these ballista. They're not very useful. Because they're pretty much used for field battles. And in field battles, well, you don't really get to use artillery that you that good. You have very, very high quality infantry and you're fighting an enemy, then it might be useful, but usually these are Artillery pieces will not be very useful. I understand what the um, with the trebuchets and the catapults.
Oh come on, I'd be so mad. How come we still haven't won this? What do they have left? Oh, they're fighting? Oh, there's a book one down there. Ouch. Well, they're gonna die for that. cover behind the house The last unit takes down a big chunk of my troops. We captured the enemy's general. That will teach the cowardly dog to turn tail and run. victory these bow units were annoying 192 enemies capture well I don't really need the money so I'll just execute them <laughs> and the regular medieval 2 I really like going like releasing everybody I'm just being nice but we're an evil faction, so we'll just execute everybody. Executions all the way. Should reinforce, yeah, that would really be a good idea. Gonna assemble a counter attack against who? Oh, yeah, stupid area door people. Create some more garrison here. How much, real quick? High Elf's Banner. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> a symbol of a crushing victory against the armies of the High Elves. Oh yes, it was, indeed. Wow. 
Well, I'm gonna send him spying. Oh, no, that's not good. How much unrest is there? Huh, we need one more garrisoning unit. And how much culture? 18%. So yeah, in one turn we'll have enough to recruit another unit to garrison there. So we should be good. I want to see what they have here. Because it's fairly possible that they just attack me without thinking about their situation. Situation? I can't... I will never be able to tell that word. And sh shit. We really, really overextended. Get ready for fighting. Please group you loud. Listen up. Listen up. Please group you loud. I'm gonna try and do counter them, but we still have the problem of these orcs and uh, dwarves. Cool, and we get a spy killed. Yep, but this is a bigger town now. Well, why can't I build a bowyer and a practice range? Now oh, that is weird. Oh, because I have a men bowyer. Already then. Really, really sorry I had another one of these fail graphics errors. Well, they occur quite often in this game, so not a big deal. I still wanted to merge these guys all into one army. And Kavlis already did that in the last time, but Are these guys any good? Oh wow, six. 11 and javelins before charge. That's some pretty good unit. Actually, these mercenaries are far better than anything I can get. <laughs> so that's pretty ridiculous. Now, since we can't build that anyway, I'm just gonna unqueue it. And I think this will be it for this episode. You now see that very hard actually starts being a pain. And yeah, well, I lose everything west of this. Uh, yeah, probably I'll be able to hold here, hold here. I'm gonna push this further back than this. And yeah, well, we'll hold good in the bed. I think we're not gonna get any further though. And I'll try push them out of Imladris, which would be a huge victory. This is a large city. It has a custom settlement thingy. And after that, I'd push them back out of here. So that'd be the plan. Pushing down here, down there, and then through here. But that's the way for another episode. Since, yeah, well, I'm not feeling the best today. So, we'll do this another time. And, yeah, that's about it. I should not get distracted and just continue the ending, ending for another couple minutes. So... I'll see you then, and thanks for watching.